Hey, why'd you leave back there when we started talking? I was just trying to be friendly, so piss off. Hey, listen. I hear you're very big in circles around here. Where did you hear that? Vegas. Las Vegas. You heard about me in Vegas? Yeah, the man to know. Let me understand something. You're talking about Las Vegas, Nevada? Yeah, right. That I'm the man to know? Yeah. Who told you about me in Vegas? Well, you know, it was in a crowd of people and your name popped up. Tall fella. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. Harry Groutman. Harry moved to Vegas, I think. It must have been Harry. Yeah, yeah, Harry. Let's understand something. I've known Harry for 30 years and I haven't seen him in 25. Al Capone, mean anything to you? Al Capone the Godfather? Lucky Luciano, Dutch Shells, Miles Latsky. Did you know them? You work for the people who work for the people. I was taking a shine too. Pardon me, but you don't exactly look like the king of the bombs. A few wrong turnings, some mistakes wrong affections. You know, you should have seen Atlantic City when it had Floy Floy. Remember that song? Flatfoot Fuji with a Floy Floy. No. Hepcat Zoot Suit. That was a Fluji part. But the Floy Floy, that was something. Atlantic City had Floy Floy coming out its ears back in the day. And the Atlantic Ocean was something. Yeah. You should have seen the Atlantic Ocean in those days. I've never seen the Atlantic Ocean until just now. I could like it here. You can breathe. Uh, we used to call Atlantic City the lungs of Philadelphia. We stay here long enough. We could be the nose of Philadelphia. Hey, Lou, could I borrow your apartment? My apartment. Yeah, just for an hour. There's a hundred bucks in it for you. A hundred bucks. <laughs> Let me tell you something. My room ain't exactly the royal suite of Casanova. No, no, it's not for a girl. It's it's technical business. And it's only for a couple hours. Grace, the old lady upstairs, she might have a problem with it. You work for that, Grace? I help her out. She pays ya? Well. Hey, you're her fancy man? Now and then. Wow, to be your agent still working at it. Mr. Stud. I keep myself in trim. So why are you afraid she'll be bad? I've got a medical problem with her. Are you a doctor? Doctor, there's something wrong with her feet. I don't, I don't know what it is. The blood just don't flow good. Well, why don't you tell me? My wife's a nurse, does massage or that kind of thing. Chrissy, she can take care of her while we're in your apartment. Come on.